Hello there, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make a simple cell, I mean battery. Okay, I'm going to delete the light, delete the camera, then uh, unfortunately I'm not going to use the default cube, so yeah, bye now. Let's add, add uh, the icosphere, not icosphere, I mean cylinder. Okay, now let's not do anything yet, don't press anything, press here, set this to 8. Okay, it's it's better if you make it a low poly first, okay? 32, I uh, consider it a high poly, okay? Now you can click anyway. Press 1, front view. Let's scale this to the Z. Make it longer, something like that. And let's begin modeling the upper one first, okay? From the, go to face select, or you can just press 3 if you're on PC. And press uh, I to insert. And I'm gonna press E to Z is true, okay? And you get something like that. Very cool, right? Now let's add another loop cut. This is for the skin. And later maybe you can we can do something later, okay? And for the below, I don't know how to make those, but I'm gonna make it even I'm gonna make I'm just making it simple, okay? I'm gonna press I to insert. Uh screw that a little bit to the Z. It's a little bit and press I again to insert. And I believe this one let me just get a little bit. Let's do that to Z just a little bit. Okay, I'm not gonna scale it there. Okay, now we got something like that. Now let's add some subdivision surface, okay? Let's see if this works. Subdivision surface. Increase it to 3. If you want 4, then go ahead in 4. If your PC is powerful, okay? Now, let's adjust some few stuff here. Add another loop cut. Control R. Over there. And for this one, you can just press 3 now. Insert. Okay. And add another one here. Make that less sharp, add in this one. Okay, now to get that sharp stuff there. Okay, now for the below, I'll press one again. Let's add another loop cut here. Okay, there we go. Let's add another one. That one, and let's add another loop cut for this one. And for this one, I'm going to face select, press I. Okay. Shade smooth. I got something like that. Okay. So that's the basic shape of my battery. Now, let's, let's shade it. Okay. Let's not apply this one first. Now, first color is the metal. The second color is the skin. Okay. And, uh, I'm going to add another one. Press new. Okay. Now we need to assign few stuff. Which I'm going to assign for the skin. Okay. Now hold this one. This. This one. Oh, control Z. Select those there. Make sure in face select. Okay. If you want to select like this. There are other ways to select. But I'm. I don't know. I'm just very comfortable using this way okay i'm gonna go to here select this one phone cage so i can select this one and this one maybe this one nah that would do okay now hit assign make sure you're in this material number two okay it's better if you if you name it so easy for you to remember sign so you can say nothing happened but let's see now let's increase this to metallic because this is going to be the metal and the specular i'm going to increase it there roughness but maybe not zero just a little there okay see the difference there i assign those uh, those color now for the slot two what color are the battery i like well uh, mostly I saw green. 
Let's make a green. You can make red. You can make blue. I'm gonna go with green. And get something like that. Okay. So that's how I make my berry, guys. What you're seeing here is a cycle render. Okay. You can see it here. Cycle. Make sure this go to GPU. And oh, for this one before the what do you call the metal part here? It's better to increase the roughness a little till 0.500. It should be fine. Okay. If you go to zero, it will be become something like mirrorish. Okay, and we don't want that. Okay, so go ahead, try it yourself, have some fun, make a model in Blender. Okay, so that's all for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time on the next tutorial. Okay, now bye now.